24. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Andrew Tolentino. Tim Trout. Today we're going to be doing an edition of Box Busters featuring Series 2 2010-11 Upper Deck Hockey. And that's Series 2 of 2. Correct. As Tim just confirmed. Tim, Tim what, do you, what do you know? What do you say? Two ninety nine a pack. 24 packs per box. 8 cards per pack. Jonathan Taves on the cover. Uh, I think we get uh, one and four on the Young Gun rookies. There are another 25, or sorry, there's another 50 in Series 2. Also, we're looking at uh, probably two hits per box, I think. Don't be angry. Just saying. You're in camera. Fire bad. Let's rip these guys up. Ooh. I almost, almost stole I one from them. Yeah, they're not. All right. I, I don't recall the, the, the wrapping on, on Series 1. But uh, what, what what are you laughing at? I don't know if that was his chair or was he your stomach growl. <laughs> my stomach? I heard a stomach growl or his chair roll. I don't know that it was my stomach growling. I did eat chicken fried steak. So. Okay. A chair did roll. A chair. Did I know. Roll. That's why I didn't know which one it was. And then yeah. I started no, no. <laughs> check okay. check out a, oh, Ian White of the um, uh, All Star Host City. Finally, Tim Trout has something to say during a video. Hands. Well, that, that, that shut him just, up. Right, hey, come on. Ian White. Focus. Focus, young Jedi. Young Jedi. Patrick Kane. I think he's one of my I think favorites. Trout's claiming to be the Jedi Master there. What do you no. think about that? Yeah, check this out. I don't no. like the look of look of this card Victory. here. Victory. Victory. Travis Hominick. Yes, and in this product, you'll get the, some Victory update cards, which will follow up from the first release of Victory, which was the first product of the year. And you'll also get a few handful of rookies that didn't quite make it into right. that first product. Which is good. Late season heroes. This time. Bobby Orr. Check out check out the back image. I like I like I like Orr's hair there. It's a good look. It's a good look for him. I don't the know. Same why. That's on the it front. just is. I, I don't know what was on the front. Ooh, ooh, it's ooh. Pretty close. Looked like uh, we got we got good use of a macro lens here. That is a Photography term, it's not a big deal. <laughs> FYI. Oh, about oh, heroic. Boar. boar. Well, he's not a boar. Um, this is, uh, did I, I didn't just show off this one, right? This is another Alexander Ooh, roll off here. You but it's an exclusive parallel. Number two, 100. Three gold. Update card. All right. Ooh. Hmm. This we mentioned UDI. So this this kind of looks like looks I like it, it belongs in UDI, but it's not. I've got a I've got an anniversary parallel here. Um, Chris Kunitz of the Penguins. I just want to show this photo because I think it's kind of it's a different photo. Is it stretching? Good use of the of the color scheme, and that's you know what seems to be the trend here. Kind of maximizing uh, the respective team's color here. And look, I, I think that these are really good looking cards. Let's see, I have a Mark Payne, Young Gun Rookie. Also had a Ryan Reeves, Victory Rookie. Ryan nice Reeves. Yes, sir. Uh oh, looks like I've got a hit. I'll show off a Vetchkin first. Because he's usually worth showing off. <clears throat> and then I'll follow it up with a card that I think looks really good. And this this is Jordan Eberly. Hmm. Hmm. Jordan Eberly. Rookie material? Some sort of rookie material. Rookie material? Uh, is that what it is? Pick, yes, it is. Hmm. Blue there. Hmm. Jeremy Morin. Victory rookie. The old Blackhawks. The old Blackhawks. The old Blackhawks. The old Blackhawks. Here's, here's another interesting photo. I'm just going to go off on photo tangents here. Okay. That's all I got. It's just an interesting photo. That's, that's what I'm talking about. He's a senator. He's a senator. We have a uh, anniversary parallel. There you go. And... Young Guns. Young Guns. You confused me, sir. Yeah, Tim Trout doesn't understand sign language. Smith, another young guy. Of 
has a lot of good coffee. photography in it. I, you know, I again think that this is a nice dramatic photo here with the, some fog of <coughs> Gary Lettman entering the ice. I just want to put that in a different pile, but I won't. Here's a victory rookie gold. I suppose it is this a gold parallel? Yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Okay. Gold parallel. So we got going on there. <clears throat> Another uh, anniversary card. How are you feeling? Are those flimsy? Things good. Yeah, they are flimsy. They're very uh nineteen ninety ish. Well I don't think ninety was that flimsy, was it? I don't know, let me feel. They weren't far off. These feel like a little, it's a little flatter cardboard mm -hmm. stock. The 90s were, this, yeah, this is definitely a flatter stock. In fact, the back is not, uh, you know the back is rough, actually. It's not a smooth surface, so right. that's probably why it's it's okay. slightly that's lighter. Okay. There's a checklist. Ooh. Featuring the caps, or capitals, sorry. Yeah. This is worth noting here. This is, this is actually um, an all-rookie team. I, the reason why I noticed it, this was because the back of these other anniversary parallels have a, have a photo, and this has, I suppose, a bio uh, regarding Duchesne's rookie year there. Let me show you my little Any difference here. Well, Nino. No more rookies. I like the name Nino. He was in a band. Batten Court. I found, I, I, I don't right. know. There were the, oh, I can't remember the name of it. Check this out. Mark Savard <laughs> apparently has Velcro. left his feet He's floating in the air. I thought it was Velcroed to the glass. He may have been Velcroed to the glass. Sweet. Yeah. Madonna and his... Or as Tenacious D says, it's Levitation Holmes. Red Wings jersey. That's Levitation. No. Tim Thomas for I think so. Tim Thomas. You know what? I've not pulled any, any hockey heroes on this side. I haven't pulled any Mem or Auto on this side. Yeah. another Mika Koiva. Not another, but hey, Mika Koiva. Davy Jones? David Jones. Not Davy Jones. I mean, what else. am I thinking? He was a monkey. He was a hockey right. player. Yeah. Is it Dino Charo? There you go. While you're over there sorting, I'm about to snag some of those packs from you, sir. Snag that one. Snag it away. I bet you that's a jersey pack. It looked thicker Seems from here. a little here. thicker. Is it? I feel kind of bad doing How generous of him. That's fine. Oh, it's another Maybe. checklist card. Fair enough. So we have the pens. Or the penguins, if the, you would. The penguins. The pen, the Featuring Crosby, who's been sidelined for quite some time now. For those of you that may have him in fantasy hockey, your host is killing you. Because he's killing me. He'll Not really. to you. Yeah. yeah. Softly. With yes. his hands. Bolts, all uniform for the lightning there. Victor Hedman. You got a hit in that pack? I did. Good. He's, he's Victory holding right. I am holding it in Hold this it. hand. I appreciate that. Too much information. Carey Price. I don't know what you're even talking about, Chris. <laughs> Carey Price, a break game jersey. So that is 2010-11 Series 2 Upper Deck. A lot like Series 1. The biggest difference you're going to find in here is a uh, new crop rookies, and there's a lot more rookie material that you're going to be able to find in this type of product. And that's similar to what they did last year is by adding one set called rookie materials, but I believe there's some other rookie inserts in here as well. It marks a good opportunity for the manufacturer to, to add, you know, to, to offer more different rookies to collectors. So yep. it's a good product. Good so, it. On sale now. Check it out at Beckett.com or at your local card shop. I'm Andrew Tolentino. I'm Tim Trout. Tim's phone's ringing. We'll see you later.